So you're a fan of the LG G6, but maybe not so much of a fan of the price tag. Well, that's why LG came up with the LG Q6. Now, one of the most compelling aspects of the LG G6 is its display, sporting a unique 18-9 aspect ratio and a resolution of 1440 by 2880. The problem is, to get one of these high-end screens, you need to buy into the high-end price. Thankfully, LG is focused on bringing its wonderful full vision display technology to lower-end devices. Enter the LG Q6, the LG Q6 Plus, and the LG Q6A. Yes, and as you've probably guessed, the standout feature of the new Q6 series are their displays. Each one has a 5.5 inch 18.9 full HD display with a resolution of 2160 by 1080 and a pixel density of 442 ppi. And like the G6, these phones also have curved edges on the screens, which are further accentuated by the subtle curves on the device's chassis. All phones in the Q6 lineup sport metallic frames made of 7000 series aluminum as well. Surrounding these 18.9 displays are minimal bezels, which were mentioned in our LG G6 review, and it will certainly help with one-handed use. Under the hood, the entire Q6 lineup features Qualcomm's mid-range Snapdragon 435 mobile platform. The Q6 Plus comes with 4GB of RAM, 64GB of storage, while the standard Q6 comes with 3GB of RAM and 32GB of storage. And the Q6A sports 2 and 16GB setups. They will all come with non-removable 3000mAh batteries also. In terms of optics, all three devices share the same 13 megapixel standard angle rear facing sensor, along with a 5 megapixel 100 degree wide angle front camera. The selfie shooters on these devices will come along with LG's face recognition feature. Now that's a nice touch too, because these devices do not come with fingerprint sensors. Now when can you get your hands on these devices? Well, LG is remaining silent on a release date right now. The company says that the Q6 will go on sale in Asia starting sometime in August, followed by availability in Europe, Latin America, and North America. Pricing has not yet been revealed. Also, LG didn't give us anything on pricing just yet but as a mid-tier device, we can be hopeful that it will be priced competitively. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. I am kind of hopeful it looks pretty good. The battery power is a little lower than I would like, but hey, if it's priced right, it could be a sweet deal. Meet Jeremy Shoemaker, otherwise known as Shoe Money, and he became famous for this photo, where he showed off a check that he made from Google AdSense. And he's become so good at making online businesses that he made an announcement that he does not start a new business unless he can secure the business's name in a .com. Now, why is that exactly? Well, no domain name extension tells your story with the same degree of trust as a .com or .net domain name. .com and .net domain name extensions inject credibility into your online presence. And who doesn't want to be credible? And don't forget, you get 15% off when you use our coupon code ANDROID. When you think domain names, think domain.com.